Good morning, investors and traders. In today's segment, I'm going to be focusing mainly on the US Tech 100 index, which has posted five consecutive weeks of gains. Now, the question is where is the index heading next from here onwards after its tremendous performance that we have seen? Before we do that, as always, it is important for me to go through this brief disclaimer and risk warnings. If you have any questions, please feel free to get in touch with your own account managers. A bit about myself. My name is Naeem Aslam. I work as a chief analyst for our trade. I come with a wealth of 15 years of trading experience. During this time period, I have worked as a hedge fund trader for Bank of New York Mellon and as an equity trader with Bank of America. Here are our social media handles, which I do recommend you guys to follow us there on a daily basis as we share important information throughout the day. So now let's have a look at the US Tech 100 index and we can begin the conversation by looking at the weekly chart. It is this particular price action which is quite intriguing for our investors and traders which I'm, I'm, I'm sure that you guys have been paying attention to because if you haven't then it is certainly a point where you should be because look we had a one, two, three, four, five five consecutive weeks of gains in terms of the price action price moving from this particular point to all the way to this particular price point which was a really a remarkable journey the in addition the price is crossed above the 50 week simple moving average on the weekly time frame but still trading below the 100 week simple moving average i.e indicating to us that yes bulls are in control of the price but the full throttle mode is still pending however when we change the time frame and when we switch it to a daily time frame the situation becomes very different over here because on the daily time frame what we really see in terms of the price action is the price trading above the 200 price trading above the 50 price trading above the 100 is simple moving averages and this indicates to us that the prices are likely to continue to move to the upside as bulls are fully in control of the price action now something which is quite important for us to pay attention to the rsi so these are called oscillators i'm going to bring that over here and it is bound to give a signal which will tell us that the prices are in fact quite overbought so now i'm going to bring that and then you can see that it is already trending near 70 and a level near 70 represents that the prices are actually too rich currently and the index could in fact see a retracement anything near 30 represents that the prices are likely to bounce back up now the fact that we have seen this tremendous rally the rsi trending over here while the prices have it, it is a confirmation that we will see some sort of a retracement now if the price is going to see a retracement where is the point where the price could actually come to now first of all we need to redefine our resistance zone our resistance zone is going to be right at the top of this particular resistance zone this particular area and then i'm going to wrap my other line just around over here around this particular candle that is my my resistance zone my area where i wanted to take my profit and my support zone is going to be where the 200 day simple moving average is trading or where the recent consolidation really happened so right around this particular area so i'm focused on this red candle and kind of a boot putting my lines around that or in other words 11,815 to 12,007 is your area of support in terms of the US Tech 100 index in terms of resistance it is the area of 13,548 to 13,748 so that is your resistance zone now is there an area in between that which could also be classified as a as as a support zone well 
if we could certainly look at that so what i'm going to do is i'm going to zoom into this area again and then i'm going to mark this area right over here the previous resistance as my in as area of support so yes the best area of support is going to be here at 12,007 but the price may not retrace it to that level fully although the chances are that we will given the geopolitical tensions that which are flaring up between the US and China but they don't tend to to go get out of our control so keep an eye on this area just as a potential area of support which is from 12,187 to 12,298 that's all for now see you guys next time